Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we are doing a spot the fake on the Kylie Cosmetics. So I have a real one here and then I have the fake one just here. So, so that is them there. So I'm going to start with the box comparisons. So this is the fake one here. So as you can see, has the holographic teeth, has the colors, the color there, has the color there, even got the stuff on the back there. So that is the fake one. The real one has the holographic teeth, the color, the back, nothing down there. So these boxes look pretty much exactly the same. The only difference is that the real one is actually more faded the lips so the lips are more faded and less pink than the aliexpress jute so the fake one was from aliexpress for i think it was about two dollars and this real one stung me a good fifty dollars and that was second hand so pretty pretty pricey there but that is the boxes and their comparison so real and fake so it's pretty scary how they've even managed to copy the holographic teeth and if anything you would think that the brighter teeth was the real one so that is quite scary in itself so that's them there and now i'm going to unbox the fake and i'm just going to start with the liners so this here is the fake liner so it's got the Kylie says called K on it and it's got the color here so it's got the wee color there and then you open it up and it's got the little round color there so now I will get the real lip liner as you can see it's got the Kylie there probably more of a cleaner one it says exactly the same things on it now the color is the big factor here this is a much purpler color here and then again that is much more purple so side by side they are pretty pretty accurate pretty much the same the only giveaway is the color there and then of course the quality of the colors and also the fake one is actually taller so if you put them flat see that little difference there the fake one is taller so now we'll just do a wee color swatch here so with this real one here we're just going to put it here now it is incredibly incredibly creamy it's a nice creamy formula it just goes on nice and smoothly just like butter so that's that one there, nice and smooth. Now we'll get our fake one. We're just going to put it here for you to see. So as you can see, it's much lighter. It feels more like an actual crayon. It's quite hard. So that is the difference in the lip liners. And then now we will get the, the fake Kylie. So the fake actual lipstick. Now it's even got the little teardrops. It's got the nice little clear bottom and it's even got I don't know if you can really tell the holographic sticker there at the bottom now we'll get the real one it's actually a little bit sturdier it's much more heavier so this is more light and flimsy this is much more heavier so you can kind of feel that it's more expensive so that is it there it's more of a bright color so these are both the same shade these are both cool okay so again it's got the little accent there and then together you can actually see that the real one is taller in this instance so the fake lip liner is taller but the the fake lipstick is smaller so that is them there and that is the shades so on camera the real one actually looks more redder while the fake one looks more purple but we'll see what they look like when we do our swatchy swatchy so I'm just going to open these up and give them a smell. So the fake one here kind of smells like baby powder. It's 
kind of got a really powdery, weird smell. So I'll pop that in there. And then the real one here has a real like kind of cupcakey, cakey smell. So it's kind of more like a like a yummy smell more than like a powdery smell. So the same ones there. And now I'm going to get the fake one out so you can see that is the applicator there. The applicator is white, so is the inside of cap, the cap. And the doe foot is a nice little kind of feathery doe foot there. So that is the fake one. And the real one is that there. So it's got a bit of product on there. So it's actually got like, I think it's kind of like a whitey see-through applicator and then it's got a wee doe foot again so the fake one is longer so I'll just get them side by side so the real one is a longer applicator applicator stick but the doe foot is actually shorter than the fake one so the fake one is below and the real one is on top so now we'll go for a hand swatch so this is the fake one here just doing swatch on there. So that's the fake one there. And then we'll get the real one and just put a swatch here like so. So on the hand these are quite very much similar shades. So this is the fake one here, and this is the real one. So they are quite similar shades, so we'll just give that a minute to dry down. So I've actually smudged it there, <laughs> got stuck on my sleeve, but it's starting to dry down now. So the Kylie is drying much more faster than the fake one here. So we'll just give that a minute. And now, we're going to do half my mouth real and half fake. So I'm just going to use the lip liners in this instance as well. So we're just going to do a test of all of it. So now that we've done the little hand tests there, or really hand test there, I'm just going to, I'll bring it closer. So I'm just going to line with the, so this is the fake side here, and I'm just going to line this lip here. So as for application, it's quite smooth to put on, but it is very opaque and very light. So it's just like that. It's the fake lip liner there. Now I'll get the real lip liner here. I'm just going to line this side. And that is the real one there. So I don't know if you guys could tell, that was so easy to apply. Much more creamier and smoother to put on than the fake one there. So that is our liners. So we've got our fake and our real. It's scary how like similar these are. So now, let's get our fake here. I'm just going to color it in. So again, it's just like a big woof of um, baby powder. So 
So that's one coat there. I feel like I could put another one on because I can, in my mirror down here, I can actually kind of see that it is quite not, so it's quite streaky and not as you know, pigmented. So that's that there. That is the fake Harley there. And now we'll get our real one. So this is incredibly, incredibly pigmented. Um, I've never actually used Kali Cosmetics before. This is the first time I've actually tried it and I freaking adore this color. This is so nice and the pigments are so vibrant. I'm actually just going to put another layer on this side just to make it a bit more dark. So this will be coat two on this side and one coat for the real one. So. I'll have to excuse my weirdly drawn lips there. So now that it's a bit darker, we'll just wait a little bit. So now that our hand ones here have dried down, so this is the real one here. You can see it's more of like a more of like a darker kind of ready base, and this is more purple tones. So this is the fake one here. So that is them there on the hand dry. I'm just waiting for them to dry on the lips. So the Kylie is dry on this side, and then the fake is on this side. So while we are waiting for that to dry down, let's give a kind of like overall rating type thing. So our fake set here, our real set here. I mean, overall, I mean, it goes on nicely. It's not overly shit. And I mean, for only like two dollars or whatever it was I mean like look at that it's not even that bad I mean when they are drying down you can't really get tell that much of a difference just more that this fake one here is more purpley toned the lip line is kind of a let down but I mean for two dollars and you get like it's like pretty much like a dollar for each thing it's kind of like wow why complain <laughs> but that is them there and then the real ones here I mean, I don't know if it's worth all the hype, but I mean, definitely the liner, it's very creamy, goes on very smoothly. The actual lipstick itself smells so good and it goes on real nicely too. So now that my lips are dry, I'll give you a wee zoomy in so you can kind of see the difference. So that is the difference there. So the fake one there is more purpley. And the real one is more of a ready tone. But in saying that, the coverage, this is two coats here. And it's probably fully covered. And this is one coat and amazingly covered. So that is that there. So now I'm going to do on my hands a little wipe off test. So I've got this and I'm just going to get a normal tissue. And I'm just going to wipe one half of this and then one half of this. So I'm just going to wipe here one wipe. So it's just one hard wipe. You can see it's pretty much taken. You can see it's pretty much taken all the product off there, still with a little bit of residue. So now I'm just going to get my tissue here and the same amount of pressure. Just going to wipe up, and I missed a bit there, but you can see that my tissue has wiped off the same amount of product there. So now I'm just going to get a face wipe. A generic face wipe and I'm just going to give this a wipe up here same amount of pressure and just wipe it so as you can see it pretty much completely came off there's just a small bit of residue there so that is with the real Kylie lip liner and then with the fake lip liner here same amount of pressure and it wipes off pretty much the same there's still that wee residue there so now I'm just going to get a plain tissue again so remembering this is the real one here and this is the fake. So I'm just going to same amount of pressure on the fake. Oh, okay. So the fake literally did not budge. The bits of tissue residue has actually embedded itself into the color. So now I'll try with the top, same amount of pressure. And you can see that 
it has smeared off a little bit there. So I'm kind of worried that this has not budged at all with the tissue, but that is okay. Now we'll go on to our wipe test. And I'm just going to get the fake and just pressure, a lot of pressure, ugh, and wipe it there. So again, if you look at the tissue, there's actually no residue. It has decided to not come off at all. That is quite terrifying. And now I'm just going to get a different part and go for this top Kylie and just give that a wipe. And again, there's actually not much either off there. So the tissue had more effect on the Kylie as a whole. Like the wipe didn't really do much and on the bottom one, nothing really happened. So this stuff is really sticky and stays and seems kind of terrifying. So I'm just going to try and get my wipe and just try and wipe it all off here. Okay. Right, I've applied the same amount of pressure and this fake one here just does not want to budge. But the real one does want to. So if, I mean, if you're wanting long wear, the cheaper one is definitely the way to go, but if you're wanting one that, you know, kind of stays on freaking ages and then kind of doesn't, <laughs> doesn't want to come off either, then maybe that one is the go-to there. Alright guys, so now we will do the kiss test. Kiss! Kiss! So as you can see, that did not budge with the kiss test. <laughs> I'm, I'm only joking. I don't know how it's going to budge. The real one here... It's long wearing, I mean, it looks pretty hard to actually get off, um, but it'll come off enough that it won't probably annoy you, you know what I mean? If you just use something oil-based, it should come off straight away, but this fake-ass one here is deciding to stay on for life, so I mean, if you want to wear a lipstick and get buried in it, and pretty much like, <laughs> never have to apply lipstick again, this is the one for you. So that is $2 off AliExpress. And as for the liners, I'm going to go Kylie on this one because it's not crayon -y. It doesn't, you know, it's not a weird pinky colour. It looks exactly like the colour here, exactly like what you would think it would be. So, I mean, overall, the Kylie Court K, I mean, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. I ain't mad at it. I ain't mad that I brought it. This fake one, it was $2. How can I be mad about getting it? So guys, that was the Spot the Fake, the Kylie Cosmetics version, and in the shade Court K. So I hope you guys enjoyed that one. So let me know in the comments below what you guys want to see next. And if you want to see more of me, then you can see me on Facebook and Instagram, it's 1307 And I will see you all soon. Love you guys so much. Bye, bishies. Uh, I'm gonna try and, and get this to shut off. Oh, come on, fake. Come on, fake. You can do it. Oh. Alright, come on, real. Let's try. Oh, that was like one wipe and it's nearly off. Thank God. And this is me using like a lot of pressure, like, oh my god.